Okay. Calculating turnover using uh, Remine. It's, uh, it's changed a little bit in the new interface. So I thought I'd record this just to show you exactly how to do it. So obviously the first thing you're going to want to do, log into Remine, right? Uh, and then if you want a specific neighborhood, uh, you, you, can, you can add the neighborhood up here in Remine. You just start putting in, you know, the name right here. Uh, and you come down here to neighborhoods and you can see there's a country club village in Seattle, one in Portland, one in Medford. So I'm in Vancouver, Washington. I'm going to put in country club vi village and uh, apply that filter. And what it's going to do, it's going to zoom right to that specific area and outline the subdivision. Not all subdivisions are in here. So you might have to actually come in here and actually draw it with your polygon, right? Now, a couple of things to note, once you have that filter applied, there's 234 results up here. Now, if you only want single family, we come down here to building type and we say single family. So 234, 188. Okay, so there's 188 single family houses, single family homes, rooftops in this outlined area. Okay, keep that number in mind because we're going to come back to it. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to the listing tab over here. Okay. I'm going to add Country Club Village, just the same as I did before, Portland. We're going to add that to the map. Um, and what I want to do is I want to come up here and say status closed. Okay. And then uh, we're going to go to a listed date and we're going to start with uh last year or actually look at that last 12 months we can do last 12 months so there's seven homes that sold in the last 12 months okay so that's right here under listing and under properties there's 188 properties in there so you take 188 go to my calculator here we go to uh, seven, seven divided by 188 equals 0.037. So there's about a 4% turnover in that area right there, 3.7%. So that is how you calculate turnover using Remind. And, and you, it'll work for an individual subdivision. It'll work for a radius, however you want to do it. But uh, I hope that helps. And if you have any questions, put them in the comments below.